Hi everyone, back in the garden again and we are starting to transplant from inside to outside. Why is that? Because it's spring, the weather is getting warmer, the soil is warm, so it's time to transplant. So today, what am I going to do? I'm going to transplant peas. You could see I've planted them um, inside, when was that? 10th of March. I've planted them and look how tall they are and I put four seeds in there and look it's growing so we're going to bring them outside and peas is beautiful crunchy sweet healthy and yummy yeah and here I've treated my soil I it's no dig I didn't really dig anything here I just add compost beautiful compost you could see the dark color here and I just rake it a bit and weed and that's all I did okay so how am I going to do I'm just going to dig a fairly big hole and how am I going to take my plant out we don't want to pull yeah because we're going to break it so we're going to protect put our finger through and just give it a squeeze you see it come out beautifully look at those roots look at that so lovely rich and healthy so we're going to put this in there try to lift and voila we've done yeah and i've got one more here and you could see i've done all the way all the way we plant we're going to get a lot a lot of harvest Okay guys, if you think you said, oh, I haven't been planted inside, you know, haven't been doing my seedling, do not fret. I've got another good one for you. So this is the pea here. This is the bag. This is the seed here. I've soaked it. It's been soaking for a while. To be honest with you, I forgot about it. Probably a week, but you don't have to soak it for a week. Maybe two days and look at those babies. This is the quick germination and you're going to plant this and your plant will be up within a few days i mean i look at these babies and and look at this life coming you know remind me life is so precious and and sometimes we do take it for granted you know and the bible say count the number of our days because you never know what can what's around the corner Today we might be here, the next day we don't know. So treasure each other, loving each other. Don't forget to tell your husband or your wife that you love them and your children and your sisters and your cousins and God knows who. But life is so precious. This reminds me, wow, this seed looks so dead, looks so, so dead and soak it in a bit of water, voila. So we are going to plant them, guys. And, and the good thing is we're going to have two harvests because those one is like we're going to have harvest very soon, probably in four weeks. And this one may be after four weeks. So harvest will be all year round, well, all summer. Okay, guys, so I've done a little drench here. So I'm going to drain the water here. And we're just going to just throw it in there. These little babies did a little hanging string so they can climb. So I've got two sticks right in the corner here. I'm going to dig it very well. And I've got all the way down two sticks. I might put two as well in the middle and I'm going to tie string all the way around so those babies can climb. And easy, easy peasy. And I'm going to water them and watch them grow. Until next time, make sure you, how you call it? Make sure you subscribe and yeah, click that little button when every time yeah, I come on. Oh. <laughs> okay guys, don't forget to subscribe and press the notification button. Check us on Facebook, Instagram and put your pictures. I like to see what's happening in your world. And until next time, more planting is coming. God bless you. But you're always gonna be